We've come to the region of Salola and we've visited this morning, we've actually visited uh, the Agricultural College. Now the college is state funded but World Horse Welfare's involvement there is that our vets and our farriers uh, go along and teach uh, the students um, in their animal husbandry but they also uh, help uh, the existing teachers and they impart new information um, to those teachers that teach the students. It was a wonderful area uh, to be in and a you know, multitude of different animals from uh, cattle to pigs and sheep and goats and chickens and rabbits and of course uh, the horses and the students learn all the skills uh, animal husbandry skills that they need uh, to go forward and uh, obviously they're looking to uh, work in the agricultural community and I would say that's pretty much if you're looking for work that's pretty much um, you know the main source of, of income is to work in agriculture. Um, now this afternoon we've come up here uh, to a different region still in the region of so Solola but um, we've come about 40 minutes to 45 minutes from where we were and we just kept going up and up and up and you can see behind me we're about two and a half thousand uh, feet above sea level and we're actually I think you can see it behind me now but we're actually in the clouds and it's just stunning it's absolutely stunning uh, scenery but we've come today for one purpose and you can probably see behind me but we've come to this clinic where World Horse Welfare set up and this particular community come and bring their horses and today um, they're having all uh, the horses shod so the farriers, uh, farriers have come up here um, to help the local community horses um, get their feet trimmed and shod and um, they check all the horses out and any information that they can impart to help these, these owners they do and they do this on a, on a regular basis. Um, but on the way up here, it was just incredible. You, you know, the, the terrain is so difficult. Even on the roads, you know, you see people walking up with huge, huge stacks of, of, of logs that they're carrying, um, you know, balanced around their heads and on, on their backs. And, you know, the horses are actually collecting um, or carrying the firewood that the people have been cutting in the forests. And it's, it's just incredible um, to see how much hard work uh, these people have to do every day of their lives.